Well, hello everybody. Thanks for joining me again. I'm here in Brixham on quite a windy day. Like most of you, I've got fed up with sitting in the house for a couple of days. So I'm out for a, a walk to uh, blow the cobwebs away. I'm gonna start at the uh, pool at Shelston and then take a walk around the harbour. And with any luck, I'll get some decent light and some uh, photographs. If not, I'll enjoy the walk. Right, let's see what I can find. Well, I managed to get this shot looking back at uh, Breakwater Beach from the pool. I wanted to get a long exposure, but it was far too windy, so I opted for 80th of a second. And then in post-processing, I've made it a little bit warmer and darkened the sky a little bit. Just as a record shot, I took this photograph of the Galatee, which is a uh, Trinity House vessel. It's used to... Uh, service light vessels and uh, navigation beacons around the country. And lastly, while I was at the pool, lots of gannets going past. So I managed to get this shot with the light on the gannet and the dark background. Not the greatest of images, but again, as I was out for a walk, I took what photos I could. Well, as you can see at the pool, it was really windy. Couldn't film much, so decided to come back to uh, the breakwater. It's a little bit more sheltered, but still very windy. Lots of people out, enjoying the sunshine and uh, finding it a little difficult to find some decent photographs, but I'll keep trying. But what a lovely day for a walk. When I'm struggling for a composition, I tend to look at the small things and then start looking for some foreground and I quite like these uh, little mooring rings that are really rusty and got some uh, character and what I was trying to do was put it in some context and I should have spent more time with this shot what I could have done was stack the image so that the background was in focus as well could have got a little lower so there was a little less separation between that sort of the foreground and the background. Well I was just walking along the road just behind the marina here. Notice I've got a higher vantage point here so I can look down on the boats. And especially with the whole fleet of uh, fishing vessels in, I thought there must be something interesting with all the rigging. It's an absolute mess but I thought there must be something in there so I've tried a couple of shots of that. Well, as you can see, a little bit of a mess. This was a little bit like uh, woodland photography. Lots of branches and lots of confusing lines. So the idea is just to pick out some uh, structure. And this next shot probably shows it better. You can see I've got the uh, windows in the background. So there's a defined top and bottom to the shot. And there's these um, radar domes throughout the image. And I quite like this.
Well, as you can see, there was lots of gannets still diving into the sea. These uh, three shots were all taken at about 230 mil, and I had it on an auto ISO, which was about 100 to 400. They're not that in focus. Could have done with a longer lens as they were a long way away. But I thought these three shots went together well. I've taken shots similar to this from this location before. Quite like this composition and the uh, long breakwater and the light lends itself to this sort of uh, long pano shot. I'm just uh, zooming back a little bit so I can get the coaster on the horizon as well. I was still on my wildlife settings at thousands of a second with an auto ISO, but the photos turned out okay. Well, as you can see, I've made it all the way around to Battery Gardens. It's been a bit busy in the harbour, so I didn't film much. And it hasn't been a great day for photography either, but it's uh, been a great walk. Lovely blustery day, just what you need after a few days of uh, eating and drinking, maybe a bit more than we should. <laughs> Although I haven't got that many photographs today, what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the description below to my website, and I'm gonna set up a page just for uh, bricks and photographs so there's no obligation to go and buy anything but if you want to just go and have a look and see what photographs I've taken from around Brixham then uh, be my guest but for now I think uh, I've seen some gannets uh, diving for fish in the bay so I'm going to try and film those and uh, hopefully get a couple of decent photographs but for now thanks for joining me Bye for now. Cheerio. Let's wait for all these cars to go, shall we? Busy day in Brixham, eh? Oh, there's a bus coming as well. Better wait. <laughs> 